G'day. In today's video, I've got a Gigabyte RTX 3060 Gaming OC 12 gig model, and I'm going to replace the thermal paste on here, um, just because they're a, got a bit of age to them. So, I'm going to start with a Phillips head screwdriver, and to take these ones out. I'm not sure if this has to be completely disassembled, but we'll see where we end up. So I'll take out all the screws that I can see. Two more at the back over here. Now I'm not sure which way this is going to open. I suspect just like that. It's probably how it's going to open. This one here. If it wants to leave. They never want to just simply leave. They want to rip the socket off with them. I don't know what they do with video connectors, but they're, they're absolutely terrible with them. I don't know if there's some special release, but they are awful. Right, there we go, that's taking the whole header off with it. So we'll cross that bridge when I get back to it. Three pins. Straight down. Anyway, while we're here, zoom in. I did accidentally tear a thermal pad there, but that's still going to be okay. I'm going to be put there. Yeah. We've got over here as well. Mm, might even see what I've got. Might have something that's the right thickness. I'm going to focus on the thermal paste. As that thermal paste is very dry. Hopefully, it wants to leave. That's some very budget thermal paste by Gigabyte there. Being the gaming OC is basically their base model card. Doesn't really surprise me. Okay. Now put some more, thermal, uh, more isopropyl alcohol on here. We'll give it a little brush. Just a little brush. made up some replacement thermal pads. So I say I'm not sure how thick these particular ones are. Pretty thin. Yeah, that one's no good. Cool. Yeah, this one too. Here to here. Go. And get them off here. Go. Now I'm going to use some GD900 thermal grease, aka thermal paste. It's fairly runny stuff. Mix it up. This should be ample over here. Yep, probably put a bit too much on there, but it is kind of watery.
put a little bit more on there. It's on there, but it's a bit thin. There we go, that's better. There. Now that's on, that's on, that's fine. Now what I want to do from here is flip it upright. Now push this back in. Didn't even need to disconnect it. Very disappointing on their behalf, on Gigabyte's behalf with that. Spend a little bit more on your connections, please. Line it up, push down, that around to actually see it properly. Go. Two little baby ones for the back. Okay. I'm assuming this clicks in here. Yep. Done. So I hope that helps with your thermal paste replacement on your Gigabyte Gaming OC. Bye.